Welcome back to Feast Fight Pack. Today's video is just a day in the life and I had quite a good few food challenges. I started the day off in my favourite way and I had cuddles with the boys. Always a nice relaxed start. Good morning, it's breakfast time. I am trying to start doing my filming horizontally because someone said that that would be better for my YouTube. Um, but it just might take me a bit to get used to because it's a different angle and everything like that, but I'm going to try it for today. Um, anyway, breakfast time. Um, I've got my teaspoon that says just breathe um, and finding Faye on it. And yeah, got my obviously increased breakfast that I'm still having. So keeping going and we've got this. So I've had a few requests to do my um, videos horizontally. I have to warn you, I did it for the whole day, but I found it so difficult. I just felt like the whole time I was like on my side. Um, but I'm gonna, I did this one and I'll see what you guys think. And if you like it, I'll try and commit to doing it for my future ones. Um, and if you don't mind, then I'll probably go back to vertical. The couple of videos I've got coming out after this one are back to vertical, um, but once I've posted this and get your guys' response, then I will either decide to commit to doing it horizontally or I'll go back to vertical. Very long way of me saying I switched my camera side all day. <laughs> snack I've got a new bar the chocolate brownie bar and I've not had this one for like three or four years so I'm gonna see if it was as nice as I remember I've not had this bar in so long mainly because it's a dark chocolate one and I'm just not the biggest fan of dark chocolate but recently I've been trying to try new flavors and just push my boundaries of like different things that I'm eating and it was actually much better than I remembered. Um, the dark chocolate isn't too bitter and it just had, it had quite a nice flavour. It wasn't my favourite of the, um, this range, but it was quite nice. Um, I'd say like a six out of 10, but that's mostly down to preference. So just not a big dark chocolate person. I'm still trying to get used to my phone being horizontal rather than vertical. I'm really trying to do this whole video hor horizontal, but um, I'm gonna see how it goes. I'll see if you guys prefer it. Um, I'm kind of not used to it. I could get used to it, but we'll see how it goes. Why am I rambling? I just ramble. Okay, focus, it's lunchtime. Um, I'm having hummus falafel in a brioche today, um, which is possibly the best combination that exists. Um, obviously still have my four part lunch, so I'll have my crisps and my sorin and my yogurt as well. Um, I've got such a big few challenges coming up later in the day for my meal plan, um, which I'm a bit nervous for. Um, and I've already pushed myself today. And again, I'm really challenging that rule of repeating flavors in a day. So I'm very much having a chocolatey day today. Um, but chocolate is good for it's good for everyone. Um, so yeah, keep going. And you're allowed to have multiple chocolatey things in a day. That is okay. No huge voiceover for this, but if you have not tried hummus falafel in a brioche yet, you need to go and try it. So good. Today is another pleasantly warm day. So much noise in this room. Uh, that's the dishwasher. Another pleasantly warm day in the UK. And so I've decided I'm gonna have an ice cream. 
and this is despite the fact I've got quite a big challenge for my dessert later. Um, I'm just challenging lots of rules recently, so yeah. Um, we've got some Cornetto type cone ones, they're the own brand ones, these ones are unfortunate because they didn't have any of the other ones and the other ones are very expensive. Um, so we picked some up from Asda the other day, so I'm going to have that for my snack today. Excuse the freezer being very full of everything that we were trying to stop from going off and frozen bananas for the dogs. Um, got my toffee cone ice cream. This was me desperately trying to get my camera to focus on the ice cream. I mean, it was pretty. Um, review on the ice cream. It wasn't good. Um, it really wasn't nice, especially compared to the Cornetto ones. Um, we tend to only get the Cornetto or the Magnums when they're on deal. So um, we got these this time. Um, it had like vanilla ice cream, like caramel sauce, and then like little fudge chunks on top. A very standard ice cream. Um, my, the cone of my ice cream completely collapsed, which wasn't great. Um, it's coming up in the video in a second. It got very, very messy. Um, yeah, literally completely collapsed as I was eating it. Uh, so I had to eat it super quickly as to not lose any cone or ice cream. Um, yeah, I would not recommend these and I would not be repeating them. I need to keep reminding myself to look at the camera on that side because I'm used to having it like this and I can see easier. Anyway, um, we're about to start cooking dinner and obviously tonight I'm having pasta. Um, but I have a big challenge for my dessert, which I'm going to show you. So I picked these up the other day and I keep on telling myself I'm going to have them and then I keep on freaking out about it. But I have got chocolate trifles. I just thought that today instead of having my yogurt and a biscuit or an ice cream, I was like, I really, really want a chocolate trifle. Um, and I've already had chocolate today and Oh, my head's being silly about it. And I also had my favorite combination of pasta for dinner. So I feel like I'm having too much of what I like and that feels scary, but it's okay to be scared. It means you're about to do something really, really brave. And just because it's scary doesn't mean it's impossible. Um, yeah, deep breath, keep going. This is me expertly cooking my pasta. So yeah, just as I said, my favourite combination of pasta, pasta, tomato, basil sauce with frankfurter sausages. Um, it was delicious. Um, I was getting quite anxious at this point because I knew I had quite a big challenge coming for dessert, but I knew I just needed to keep on going. And then it was chocolate trifle time. Uh, this was very challenging, but I knew I wanted to do it. Um, it's difficult having it on the same day as having ice cream. And also I had a chocolatey bar in the morning and just trying to work on that rule of repeating flavors. Um, but it was delicious. I got them a few days before and I knew I really wanted them. Had like cream on top, then chocolate mousse, then a layer of chocolate cake and then chocolate sauce on the bottom. It was a chocolatey heaven and it was absolutely delicious. I managed all my dinner and all my dessert, which um, I know it's the right thing to do. Um, it just doesn't feel great at the moment, um, but I had a cuddle with hugs, um, and I know that this feeling will pass, um, I'm going to go and get into some more comfortable trousers that accommodate poor bloating, um, I know it's not something I've particularly spoken about, um, on my journey is the physical um, side of things 
Um, and the reason for this is because I don't like talking about it because for me it makes it more real and then I start struggling with it more. I'm much more um, a distraction person and pretend it's not happening because bloating goes down and goes away. But yes, it is um, difficult and it is something I'm experiencing a lot at the moment, especially as I've done a lot of meal plan increases at the same time. Um, so, yeah, I'm fine. Me and mum are going to go on my little walk because I've not been yet. Um, and then I'm going to do my paint by numbers and... I know what I did today was right with my meal plan, um, obviously not finished, I've got my night snack coming, um, but I know I've done the right thing and I know the fact it feels this wrong means it's the right thing. Um, I just really like my thoughts to slow down a little bit for just a little bit, but it will come in time. We went on my little walk and then came back and I did some of my paint by numbers, and then I had my night snack. And I wanted to finish this video on this quote. I have got a couple more very exciting videos coming out very soon. Um, you'll understand why when I post them that it's taken a little bit longer. Um, but thank you for being patient with me.